Okay, so today's video is going to be a show and tell about my new units. Units that I've already had, I've one of them I've already had and one of them is new to me. So the first one we're going to talk about is the one I have on my head. This is a faux bob. It's three ways to wear. You can wear it with a faux bob, you can wear it in a ponytail, and you can wear it with a loose wave. This unit that I'm wearing is called Tammy. This is by, where's this by? Okay, so it comes like this in the regular bag. It's Tammy by Outre, and the color is a 1B. Let's see, what else do I need to tell you guys? This was $43.99 and I got this at Beauty Supply Store. It has an L lace parting. So you can wear it three ways. But as I said, the ponytail, you can do it in the, the ponytail, you can wear it in the loose or you can wear it in the bob. So I don't know who would wear this as a bob, but that's how it would look. I guess it would be kind of cute if you wear it like that, I guess. So I'm gonna show you guys. It doesn't tell you how many length, how how long this is, but it looks like this. Comes down until it's pretty pretty long. If I was to show you guys. It goes all the way. It's basically to like a couple of inches before I wore it today for the first time and i do not like it i don't like it at all i feel like it tangles a lot i mean it's synthetic hair so of course it's, this one does tangle a lot so once you get it i have to fix the parting but so this is how it comes it's going to come with a lace right you're gonna get the lace and you're gonna have to cut the lace now it has the l parting I've already kind of altered my parting by adding a little bit of powder and a little bit of foundation. And I also tweezed the part just a little bit, just to make it a little wider. So I'm gonna take this off so that you guys can get a better understanding of how it looks on the inside. So I'm gonna tell you guys the pros and cons of this unit. So it has it has the typical weave comb here, and it has the weave comb here. Now, and this is your L parting. That's your L part. Now it's been a while since I've worn a synthetic lace front wig, and I see why it's been a while. So it comes with this stiff, hard lace that's extremely hard and extremely stiff. And wearing it today, I just, I don't like it because I feel like that hard lace is gonna damage my natural hair right here, which, which would cause you to potentially lose your edges. So I personally, I don't think I'm gonna wear this all the time. I think this is just gonna be a wig that I maybe throw on for emergencies when I really just need to go out and I need hair. So it's like a loose wave. The texture, you can see, it's like a loose wave kind of texture. So you have that part, right? I put a little concealer foundation. You can see it's a little bit light. So overall, and then it also has this little pouch thingy here. Uh, this is where you can tuck the hair in. I guess when you want to wear it as a ponytail, you can tuck that in. But I don't know who's going to walk around with that, like with a big bulge in the back of their head. So, let me show you guys what I do, right? So, depending on how you want your part, depending on how you want your part to lay, you can part it, part your natural hair that way. I'm going to make a little tiny parting indentation so let's pull that like right there once you make a part in your natural hair 
which is why I said if the lace is softer, but of course it's not going to be soft lace because it's a synthetic wig. Because you need, in order to make it look natural, you want to kind of leave out a little bit of your part just so that the fake wig can lay on top of that parting. So now I'm just putting the combs in, in the back to give you stability. I put the combs in and I put the comb in up here too. All right, so I'm going to take some black eyeshadow. I have some black eyeshadow and I'm gonna just take that and I'm going to generously place it on the lace that's showing. And that's just gonna make it look a little bit more natural. Let's say with the wind blows, you just kinda want it to blend in. So now you can see it looks a lot more natural. So the parting is a lot better. It actually looks like it's coming out of your scalp once you apply that from that concealer, not concealer, but when you apply your eyeshadow to cover up that lace, it kind of blends everything in. So now I'm gonna comb this out. So the, the tangles is more so in the ends. I just wanna see the texture. It's not really shiny. It's not that shiny like a lot of synthetic care is. So that much I will give them. It's not that shiny. So I'm gonna comb it out from the bottom. And I honestly just feel like it's too much hair for me. I just think it's too much hair. And I never say that a unit is giving me too much hair. But this, this is just too much hair. Like, I don't know, maybe I should cut it. I'm thinking I should cut it like this short. So it'll be like a nice bob. Not, not that short, but I think I should cut it. So once you've applied that, you have made your part look a lot more natural. So once your parting is a little bit more natural, what I like to do is I take some hair from here. See, it's tangled. Tangled, I don't like that. Take some hair and I put the hair behind my ear and that's how I like to wear it. And I kind of just pull it out a little bit right here just to cover up any extra leave out. Comb it down here. See? And you're good to go. And your part looks very natural. You can see from the side, you can see from the top. Keep in mind that I did tweeze the parting a little bit more because it was extremely small and we did add some foundation. Hope so you enjoy. when the wind blows your hair back, you're not seeing a bunch of like lace. So the wind is going to blow 
and your hair is gonna be fine. So if you guys wanna get this wig, this is Tammy, my show and tell of Tammy, faux bob, lace front, by Ultra. Okay, so if you guys like this one, you can go out and get it, but I think...